Hey guys, Mist here again for another video today, and we are back with a, another Ottawa Senators franchise mode video today, and uh, we are in the playoffs. We did a, we had a pretty good season, went 53-24-5. and five. Finally, this team finally gets to simulate well enough where we actually make the playoffs. We finished first in our conference and uh, second in the entire league. Uh, because of regulation and overtime wins, unfortunately. So uh, we were close. We definitely could have uh, won the tro President's Trophy, but unfortunately we couldn't. So not that big of a deal, though. But let's go and let's go see what the Florida Panthers are looking like. We have a very high locker room chemistry right now, so we could be simulating fantastically. Uh, but let's go see. So Ekblad is their best. Is that Barkov? <laughs> Uh, uh oh, uh, I was oh okay, Rip Carlson man. Okay, I was thinking Carlson was still captain to be honest. But uh, let's go and see uh, their team. But the Ekblad is their best player. We obviously took Barkov from them. So uh, yeah, let's go and see what the team is looking like. So they got Huberto, Trocheck, and Sam Reinhardt. He is different. Obviously not actually a Panther. He is a Sabre because he was drafted second overall in 2014. Right behind, uh, who was it? Wasn't it Ekblad? Yeah. Ekblad went first. Uh, Reinhardt went second. And then uh, Sam Bennett went third. So, all right. Back to the lineup. So, first line, Jonathan Huberto with Vincent Trocek and Sam Reinhardt. Pretty good first line. Um, yeah, all right. Uh, second line, UC Jokinen, Nick Bukestad, and Riley Smith. Obviously just got acquired by the um, Las Vegas Golden Knights, so, you know, he's not there anymore. Thomas Vanek, now a 77 overall, still playing on that third line, though, with uh, Jace Harlock. Harlock, uh, yeah, sure, I don't know how you say it. And Jonathan Marcheseau, who also is now a... Um, Vegas Golden Knights, so that's funny to see. Colin Greening playing on the fourth line. Obviously, he was on our team. I got rid of him. Uh, Stephen Hodges is playing with them uh, at the center position. Uh, at the center position, sorry. And then Colton Sevier is also on the fourth line. Defensively, Keith Yandel uh, still kicking, 33 years old. And then Aaron Ekblad, a 95 overall. Michael Matheson and Jason Demers makes up their second pairing. Um, Michael Matheson looks to be like a pretty solid goaltender. Let's go to Ian Makoshin and Alex Petrovic, uh, their um, third pairing. Pretty decent defensive core. Let's go look at their goaltender, uh, Samuel Montombo. And uh, James Reimer has their backup. So Montembeau is only 83 overall, but let's see how he simulated this year. He had a 238 and a 923, so definitely uh, nothing we can take advantage of uh, entirely. So we are going to have to go and hopefully play better than them. But uh, looking at our lineup, our offense is much better than theirs, and our defense is also much better than theirs. So hopefully we can do good, but uh, we will see. Let's go and start the sim. Um, I'm going to have to back out of all this. All right, there we go. Let's go and start the sim. See if we can move on to the second round for the first time. Don't know why I'm doing it like this. I didn't mean to do it like this. Ugh. All right, let's start the sim. And then there we go. All right, so game number one in Ottawa. First period. We're down to nothing. All right, uh, Hodges and Trocheck make it to nothing. Now we are down going into the second period. Let's see. And all right, awesome, Kamenev and Godin or Godin. We tie the game. Now two two going into the third times eight speed going into the third period with a tie game of 2-2. Vincent Trocek gets his second of the night to give the Panthers a lead and Harlock makes a makes it a 4-2 game. Now a power play for the Panthers. They are just running away with it by the looks of it. We got a power play. Couldn't do anything with it. 
now down to five minutes left not looking too good for your ottawa senators and colin greening former senator gets a gets the dagger with uh, a 5-2 score line now and uh we lose game number one five to two trocek with two goals all right so now uh, we uh, could be in a bit of trouble, hopefully uh, not, though. Let's go and try the second, uh, or let's go try game number two of this series. We are down one nothing. Our Bingington Senators have made the playoffs. Awesome, but let's go. Come on. First period, Vincent Trocek again scoring. Now has three goals in two games in four periods of play, so... He's doing really good. All right, down one nothing going into the second period. Let's see if we can improve off that one because that wasn't too great. All right, so Shane Prince makes it 1-1. Then literally seven minutes later, Haraluk scores his second of the series to make it 2-1. Going into the third period, we will slow sim it. Let's see, power play for the Senators. Nothing can come from it. Only uh, 12 more minutes left. Power play for the Panthers and Jonathan Marcheseau makes it 3-1. Another power play for the Panthers. They can't get another one down to five minutes of this period. And we are going to be going to Florida down to nothing in the series. Uh, this isn't looking good. Not looking good at all. Oh, man, Montembeau at a 964. Wow. Trocek and Harlock with a goal each. All right, let's go. And uh, now hopefully we can make something happen in Florida, but we are down 2-0 in the series, and we are going to play away the next two games, so not looking too good for us. But uh, we can do this, boys. Come on, I know we can. Let's go. First period. All right. 0-0. Zero, zero. We are out shooting them. Hopefully uh, we can do something in the second period. I'm don't I'm kind of don't really know what to say. So second period. All right. Shane Prince makes it one nothing. <clears throat> there we go. We finally have the lead. I think for the first time in this series. And this game three. That is really bad. All right. <clears throat> All right, let's go. Uh, second period. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, rip. I didn't mean to do that. We won. I said second period, and because I thought we were going into the second period. My bad, guys. So we won the game 2 nothing. Glenn Godin and uh, uh, Shane Prince with a goal each. My, uh, Carter Hart with a shutout really means a lot, buddy. Looking good now. Okay, so I didn't mean to... Um, do uh, to sim the third period like that so i am sorry about that guys but now let's go and see who we are facing in the ahl we are going against the toronto marlies the battle of ontario in the ahl that's kind of sick um if bingingham is in ontario i'm actually not sure but let's go game number four first period and stephen hodges makes it one nothing we are shooting them but uh Montembeau is a solid goaltender obviously if you haven't been able to tell by now let's go second period all right there we go that's more like it Chabot and white scores two back-to-back -back goals and we are now at where we now have a lead going into the third period up to one against the panthers Let's go. We'll actually slow sim it this time because I forgot to the last time. And Vladislav Komanev makes it a 3-1 game. Looking good as of right now. Never mind. Jason Demers makes it a one-goal game, and we have got a game now. Ten minutes left in the third period. Can we hold on to the league? Matthew Barzal makes it 4-2. Looking like we can tie up the series. Looking like we will tie up the series. One minute to go, and we have 4-2 victory. Okay, I forgot to look at the three stars. I'm sorry about that, but looking good now. Uh, we're going back to, uh, on home ice, but uh, home ice has meant nothing so far. So if we can get this home home ice victory, we could be in a very good position. 
All right, let's go. First period. Ooh, Barzal makes it one nothing. Then Stephen Hodges, he's just a goal scoring beast, makes it one one. Then Godin and Barzal gets a second of the period. Uh, so there we go. We are three one now going into the second period. Lots of shots, lots of goals that period. Let's go. Second period. Okay. <laughs> wow, this is a goal fest. All right, Barkov makes it. Um, 4-2, or sorry, 4-1, then Carlson makes it 5-1, then Haraluk and Trocek bring it back to make it 5-3, then Lauren Dauphin with 39 seconds left brings it to a 6-3 game. Now we have a three-goal lead going into the third period. Power play for the Panthers. Obviously, we can't count them out yet. Anything can happen. Both goalies are not doing too great. I mean, there's been a lot of shots, though, so... Uh, looking like we might even crack 40 so and we have so one minute to go can we win and we do we finally get that home ice victory looking good Barzal with three points Carlson with three points and Dauphin with two points so that is good now let's go and uh, eliminate them now after and let's win four straight going back on their home ice Let's edit some scouting assignment really quickly. We will go here for three weeks. Um, all right, let's go. Now on home ice for the Panthers. Let's see if we can win on the road and uh, take it or take this team into the second round. Come on, Carter Hart, I need you to play strong this game, buddy. First period, Barzal and Barkov, our first liners, doing wonders for us right now. Completely outshooting them, and uh, it looks pretty good so far. Let's go, second period. Okay, we're up 3-1. Jean-Gabriel Pajot makes it 3-0, then Thomas Vanek, the 77 overall, might I add, uh, scored from the point. But um, we Pajot scored from the opposite side of the red line. Oh my, oh my God! Wow. All right. Sick. <laughs> All right. So that's great. Uh, now we go into the third period. Up three one. Let's see how we respond to this lead. 12 minutes remaining of the third period. We could move on to the second round. Five on three power play for us. So we cannot score. Come on, boys. We got this. Let's go. Come on. Two minutes remaining. One minute remaining. And Michael Dalcall, everybody on the first line scores in game number six. There we go. Looking good. Finally get to move on to the second round. Carter Hart with a 956 save percentage. Del Call with three points. All right. Looking good, boys. That is awesome. Now let's go and simulate up a day. Actually, let's go see the RAHL. Uh, let's see how we are doing down here. Series is tied 1-1. Let's uh, move on a day. Uh, let's see if we get our playoff match in the NHL and can we win? We do not win. So now let's go um, <clears throat> All right, so we do have our playoff matchup in the NHL now Can we even the series in the AHL or are we gonna get eliminated? We even up the series. All right, there we go So let's go see who we are facing in the second round uh, well, I can see it right there because I'm special. It is the Buffalo Sabres. They went 4-1, and one, so they did pretty freaking good. But uh, there we go. Moving on to the second round, let's go look at some statistics to see how our players have been doing. All right. Uh, all right, six points for Eric Carlson, play a point-per-game player. That's good. Barzal has four goals. All right, so he's doing good. Del Call has four assists. He's doing good. Dauphin, Pajot, Godin. Godin has three goals. Uh, Barkov has two. Prince has two. Kamenev has two. Is there someone that doesn't have a point? All right, Ryan Murray, the only one that doesn't have a point. Buddy, if you want to win the cup, you got to get some points, just so you know. But uh, all right, how is Carter Hart doing? Uh, looks like he f may have finally found his stride. 2.34 isn't good phenomenal 922 is uh good i mean they're both pretty good obviously definitely could be better we will look to move on to the conference finals in the next episode 
And, uh, all right, guys, that's going to be it for me. Hopefully you all did enjoy. We finally move on to the second round. And goodbye, Les Panthers. I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace.